Mike's eyes full of <laughs> <laughs> Good morning guys, I'm trying to be like all like cool but listen to my shoes. <laughs> I'm over at Autotopia again. Um, Sean's over here. We're gonna have two sick ass cars. You'll recognize one car from a movie. I'll let Sean talk about him. for a ride and show what these big guns do Bam! so today me and Mike and Mike are gonna we're gonna go for a drive in the in the CUDA this is a originally it started as a 1970 CUDA this car was built by Dave Salvaggio who now started a company called speed core this car was built about 14 years ago and still holds up the physical look of it is I think is a fairly timeless car to be honest with you I mean look at it right it's just cool big horsepower torque you know it's just it's it's one of those builds that has held up and then this car because my neighbor does the fast and furious movies this car ended up in fast and furious 6 they liked it so much they made a stunt double of it and that's the car you see letty driving in fast 7. um it's just an exceptional car and i'm looking forward to doing some burnouts with those guys and and uh seeing if it holds up in their world <laughs> yeah, I've got to start using that word bitch. <laughs> my, uh, my, my description of this car always is, it honestly, to me, it looks like this is what the devil would drive. Yeah. You know? <laughs> it's just instant cool points in this car. Hey, Mike, I feel badass. You feel badass? Yeah. <laughs> Instantly. That's unique. Are you, are you guys ready to go on a ride? Like, instantly, when you get in here, your cool points go out the roof. Seriously. I'm cool. Yeah, see? Yeah, even Mike can be cool. Look. I'm cool. I mean, did you guys saw the, the Crazy Cart video? Lost all of his cool uh, points. I was still cool. Lost all of his cool points. He might actually be cool today. Maybe. It sounds amazing, by the way. <laughs> um. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> Mike. How do you fold the seat down? Okay, I lost my cool points now. <laughs> we can't. Usually, there's a lever here or a lever here. Why don't want to jam your plan? Right here? Is there a lever here? No, we're up. Oh, there you go. Well, right, yeah. I thought you were going to fold it down. So we're so screwed back. I forget. There's actually decent amount of space Just up here because great. when this car was made I, I love this car. Asians weren't around yet <laughs> so it was here for tall American people because <laughs> like the act I look I can still stretch I know I how are you but oh well you're screwed no yeah I'm good don't worry yeah, I'm in labor I'll tell you you want it <laughs> oh beautiful yeah the design function of this car is not comfort the design function of this car is I will smoke I got that boom We had a cool job. He has a cool job because he gets all of these badass cars beyond our cars. And he gets to drive them. I'm very lucky. Yeah. I really and when he said when he drives, he actually like drives. Mexico. <laughs> I mean, that's what they were made for, right? Right. I'm not a fan of perfectly beautiful cars yeah. that never get to see the road. Now we're finally driving in the Cuda. It's a 
70 CUDA, built by Speedcore about 14 years ago. Um, you know, one of the things I love, love, love about this car, and you guys are going to feel it in just a second, is it's just pure low-end grunt. It's, it's a fairly angry car, but it's just grunt, you know. got to be somewhere close matching in torque, right? I mean, wouldn't you say that's probably in the yeah. 700 range torque? But I love it too, because this car, you know, man, you can, yeah, you can pound on it, but it's just cool to cruise too. I mean, this is, oh my God, look at this thing. Go for a nice drive. No, for a lot of you guys, you don't have to drive a car to appreciate it. Everyone's always, let me drive your car, let me drive your car to do this and that. You can be a passenger and appreciate the build, the quality, and experience, you know? I agree, Because for me, it's like, driving other people's cars, that's why I don't do a lot of car reviews on my channel. Yeah. It's because it's too much responsibility. It is. If I can't replace it, I don't want to really drive it. You know, even driving my buddy's GT350, I'm like, uh, you yeah. really, really want to drive it? Yeah. And it's like some people, because I've heard many horror stories of people driving others' cars, and it's like, in a pole. Especially when it's not your car, you want to smash them. Yeah. And that is the Cuda. That is the Cuda. Oh, nice. You like? like Next it. car? I like a lot. I Next know. car? Insane. <laughs> What up, guys? I'm tired. Ah, uh, really? Can you unpack it? Hey, that's a nice. Is that a wrap? Oh no, that's on that. Um, no, it looks like paint. It's nice Audi though. RS7, dude. Oh, I want one. Look how fake the mufflers are. It's like two little ones with one big circle scope. <laughs> We're going to Portos. People are looking at us like, "Why are you looking at his car?" In the park. Some dude. <laughs> We're currently in the city of Glendale. If you guys don't realize, Glendale is fairly nice. Um, affluent affluent community uh, pretty terrible drivers and we're visiting this phenomenon called Portos Dude, this place always freaking packed and one thing about being in LA you have to pay for parking everywhere pay for the parking huh yeah. we're gonna be here for five minutes you have to pay for parking legitimately order two for pickup I literally just came here picked it up came outside yellow thing on my car I was like what yeah. the fuck so 50 cents for 36 dollars so many people here for a big It's crazy. Mike's currently uh, shooting an email over to the Jay Leno guys. With my cracked screen. We're um, doing some sick ass stuff, dude. Some sick ass stuff. Half a dozen chicken up and What do you guys have? The ice coffee, you have the large size coffee, the regular. Two meat pies. They're fat. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't get. And then right here I have uh, the two uh, spicy peppers. The three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Target croissants. Is that correct? Okay. Got one, Another two, nine. Four, six, okay. Yeah. So it's that 18. one is wrong, correct? Yes. Okay. Everything here. 